It's the magic of math here, and today we're going to be talking about a real-world ratio. Here's our question today. We have a book club that has 36 members. There are 24 boys and 12 girls in the club. We're asked, what is the ratio of the number of boys in the club to the number of girls in the club? And you're given four answer choices. Here's where you pause the video, make your best answer choice, and then come back to see the solution. Welcome back. Let's look at the information that we've been provided. We know that there are, we're looking for the number of boys to the number of girls, and we're going to write a ratio. So we're told that we're going to do boys to girls, and we can see that our ratios are all written with a colon, and you can do a ratio three ways, a colon, the word to, or with a fraction bar. So moving on, we need to find the number of boys and the number of girls in the club. So we can see that there are 24 boys and 12 girls in the club. So when we rewrite that, we have 24 boys and 12 girls. And remember, order matters. If they said boys to girls, you have to have the number of boys to the number of girls. The reverse is not the same. So if we go and we look, we can see that we have answer choice B. Let's note that you've been given this other numerical value, saying that the book club has 36 members in it, which was a distractor. You did not need this number to solve the problem. It comes from if you add 24 and 12 together, meaning add all the boys in the club and all the girls together in the club, you get 36, and that's 36 members. But again, they were just trying to trip you up and have you check answer C or D. So our answer choice is B, boys to girls is 24 to 12. And there you have it. At The Magic of Math, we're talking about real-world ratios. I thank you for joining me today as we continue to master math one video at a time. I hope you have a great day and come back soon.